My name is Carl Deutsch. I'm a graphic designer, and this segment is on how to make a Polaroid in Photoshop. Polaroids don't really seem to be around much these days um, for various different reasons, uh, but you may find in your design that you want to include something that looks like a Polaroid, but actually comes from a nice, clean, crisp digital image that's taken with today's, more today, today's technology. Um, this is kind of the finished product. Basically what it is, is it's the image inside with an extended canvas on the outside of it. This is one quick, easy way of making a Polaroid, or making an image appear like it's a Polaroid. Um, obviously this image is much crisper. Uh, you may need to throw some filters on it or adjust the colors to get it to look a little bit older or not quite the quality or the exact quality that a Polaroid image is. So I'm going to go ahead and close this and open the original image. Oops, sorry, that's not the original. This is the original. Okay, so as you can see, there's no border around it. It's just the image. So I'm going to go ahead and turn my rulers back on using Command R. First step is to add the frame around the top right and left side. So you can see the image is four inches by four inches. If I increase that to 4.5, by 4.5, you see it adds that frame. So now that's just an equal amount all around. You want to get that heavier border at the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead back to canvas size, come to your image menu, and change that so it's pushing the image area out on the bottom. So I want to change the height to 5.5. And that adds more image area at the bottom. Now if that's too much, it looks like a little bit more than what a Polaroid really is. Let's click undo. Go back to canvas size. Instead of 5.5, let's do 5.25. Now that looks a little bit more like a Polaroid of a, of a plate of lasagna. So now if you want to adjust the colors of that a little bit to make it look a little more like a Polaroid, because that looks just way too crisp to be a Polaroid, go ahead and just select that with your marquee tool. It's a basic, simple marquee tool. Maybe go to your color adjustments or your hue, saturation, and just kind of mess with the colors a little bit to throw the colors off a little kind of make it a little greener. I know that kind of looks like gross lasagna. Sometimes the saturation is blown out or sometimes it's a little less. Lighten it. You can really adjust the colors here to make it look a little more like that. And there are filters and all kinds of other things you can use. My name is Carl Deutsch, I'm a graphic designer, and that segment was on how to make a Polaroid in Photoshop.